Hello from Slovenia again. Today I will do a flower with this 3D printed flower shaped cup. So I will put this on and I'm using um, grayish blue from Amsterdam for my background. Blue gray, grayish blue, yes. And I have permanent red violet from Amsterdam and I have Venetian rose from Amsterdam and where is copper? And copper from Amsterdam and my pearl white mixture that it's Vallejo pouring, uh, pearl medium mixed with titanium white and my pouring medium and you will find link to my mixing paints video in the description box. So let's do some cup bottom reverse flower dip today. Pearl white and I will add copper next. I'm just trying to pour in the middle of this. Okay. And a touch of pearl white again. And permanent red violet. Venetian rose. And let's go with pearl white again. And copper. white again and violet and Venetian rose again Okay, and I will switch it today. So, turn it around or whatever the right word is again. While I'm doing uh, waiting, I will just create some petal shapes with my skewer. I think that this flower should look quite nice because I like this combination. I will just lift it and turn it around. Okay, I think that I'm good. Put this back on. And let's add some pearl white again. And some copper. And this 
Ovelet. And Venetian Rose. And I will end up with copper this time. So I will add some pearl white and copper or maybe with violet. Let's add some of this violet on the top of copper and this will be it. Okay. I just bl blow this paint just that it uh, slide off my cup easier. So I will spray my oops, napkin with water. If you didn't, if you watch this for the first time, uh, I have a lot of videos about this technique, so you can check maybe some of my other videos if you see how much I spray my napkin or something because. Um, I did quite a few videos with where I'm explaining everything. So I will just drag this to, to the towards the sides just to create this petals here too. And I will bring this towards the center a little bit. I really like these colors together, so I hope that this will look nice like it looks now. <laughs> okay. So let's bring my paper napkin put it down carefully on one side and on the other side Okay, and gently touch, gently touch, <laughs> it's not pressing, I'm just touching, just to make sure that my napkin touches the paint on every part of this painting, this is all. You don't want to press this, just touch and let's try to leave this as nice as we can. <laughs> okay, another four corners sides I have to say this one this one and the last one Slowly up. I 
have to bring this a little more to the middle but otherwise I think that it's so gorgeous I like these uh, colors together because uh, I don't know I just like them and the flower is a perfect shape and colors in the flower are goes perfectly together for my taste so let's torch this and of course I will pour some some of my base around just to even it up a little bit I just like to do that because uh, that's how uh, it's easier for this paint that uh, there is a little more paint in the middle obviously because you pull your paint towards the middle with paper napkin or towel or plastic or whatever you use so it's uh, it will uh, level out a little more if you add just a little of uh, your base and then uh, Obviously, you have to torch once more. I sometimes spin it a little bit, but today I will not because I think that it's just perfect like it is. I just blow here a little bit just to help it. And here is the close-up. What do you all think? I think that these colors are just gorgeous together. And this perfect white lacing this time with some cute cells around. I think that and the center is okay. So I'm really happy with this one. Uh, let me think what you think about it. Do you like it too or I will definitely use this color combination on maybe black background too because I think that it would look nice or you can tell me on which uh, base coat should I use those colors together because I really want to use use it use them again because they are just perfect together so this is it for today and see you on the next one bye